Oh god, that is so good. Um, yeah, I felt like I needed just a little bit of that to uh, help me get through this video. I have a lot to explain because I've gotten a lot of comments in the past few months on my Design the Skyline video, which is, can you believe it, two years old. I've been doing this channel for about a little bit upwards of three years, closing in on four pretty soon, so honestly, I stumbled across Jane Riella's video about Design the Skyline and Jeffree Star, and this one girl, I don't know if it was a girl or a boy, posted, like, does anyone actually legitimately like Design the Skyline? And I felt like I had to answer his or her question just by saying two years after I made my one and only video about Design the Skyline, which I was fairly nice in, mind you, but I still got comments telling me to kill myself and that I'm ugly, but besides that, like, I still get fucking hate comments all the time, still telling me that I'm ugly and that no scene boy will ever find me attractive, which really isn't much of a loss because scene is pretty much dead, and everyone that was pretty much a scene kid in my time when I was in middle school has now become a hipster, so that's pretty much passed on, and now we're in the age of hipsters instead of scene kids anymore, so whenever people say scene is dead, yes, scene is dead. I there are barely any scene kids left. That whole thing is just past and it's it's no more. But anyways, I feel like I got a lot of comments today just from this one guy and honestly I'm not really thinking much of it because he really did not have a good command of the English language. But the more I think about it, the more I should clarify about how my tastes have changed in recent years. Honestly, like, I know I've, like, compared Lady Gaga to, like, Katy Perry and Kesha in the past, but honestly, like, I don't mind Lady Gaga that much anymore. I kind of like Lady Gaga. I mean, I'm not, I'm not listening to her music, like, 24-7. Like, it's not, like, heavy metal to me at all. What I mean by that is, like, I'm not gonna listen to Lady Gaga as much as I listen to heavy metal, but actually, she's quite a competent musician, and she definitely has an understanding of music theory, and... She's a very, very good piano player, and she's got, she's actually fairly a likable person, so I'll give her that. I, I, just, I definitely like her a lot more now. I mean, I'll definitely say I'm a little bit less of, well, a lot less of an elitist than I was back in sophomore year. And honestly, a lot of changes have happened since I've started this channel. Like, I used to be like, marginally seen when I started this channel, you'll notice that, like, the very first video I ever did, it was just me showing, like, how all my music was better than yours, and then I, like, pulled out my rainbow extensions, <laughs> and oh my god, that video was so fucking embarrassing, because, like, I just had my head so far up my own ass, and, like, honestly, who doesn't think that if they could go back to their freshman year that they wouldn't kick their little asses, I mean... Just think about that for a minute. If I could go back to freshman year, I would kick my freshman- I would kick freshman Riley's ass because she was a bitch. I mean, I'm still a bitch now, but I mean, I'm definitely not as bad as I was. And you know, sophomore and junior year, those years were hard for me and just a lot of shit happened. And I'll honestly say 2013 hasn't been too bad to me, but I don't know. Just a lot of things have changed, and I definitely do not think the same way I do, like I did in the Design the Skyline video. See, that's the thing, scene kids. People change, and if you give them two years to change, then they're a lot different from when they first started, from when they first made the video. I mean, you'll look at the girl who did the emo scene kids suck video, Archmix. She changed a lot ever since the video was made, and like six, seven years after the video was posted, she still gets hate videos, and she's forgotten all about it. And I feel the same way about the Design the Skyline shit. I mean, I'll respond to your comments just, like, telling you you tell me is... doesn't make sense. Like, when people say I'm ugly because I don't like Design the Skyline, yeah, that just makes all the sense in the world, because music taste has a direct correlation with your physical appearance. Anyways, my point of this video is that People really need to learn to let things go. Will we ever learn how to? I'm not sure. I mean, 
I don't know, there's some things I still can't let go. I'm a big grudge holder, but I mean, if someone doesn't like the same band as me, I don't hold a grudge over that. I'm actually friends with a lot of people that don't like the same bands as me, like... I know a lot of my friends don't like Guns N' Roses or despise the Rolling Stones, yet those are, like, my two favorite bands in the world, but I'm still, like, I'm still friends with them. Like, that doesn't make a difference, and I don't know, it's just, it's kind of hard to explain. People do change a lot in a few years, and like I said, I do not think the same as I did in the past few videos, like... Some of the Dove stuff coming out recently, I hate to say it, but I can tolerate it. Like, it doesn't make me want to rip my own ears off whenever I hear it. I mean, they played a lot of Dove stuff at my junior prom, and I was just kind of like, oh, okay, you know, people dance to this, people are having fun, and everyone's liking this DJ. He's a lot better than the homecoming DJ, so what, what the fuck not? Let's just, like, let's just go through this and have some fun. It's prom, whatever. But, and then some pop music that came out in 2013, I really don't mind that much. I mean... I used to be so stubborn about that stuff, and now I'm kind of glad that I'm not, because I've branched out into a few different genres of music. Like, I've definitely gotten more into the indie stuff, but, I mean, I'm still very, very into heavy metal, but I've definitely branched out into a few different genres and found some stuff that I liked and some stuff that I didn't, but, I mean, the stuff that I like definitely outweighs the bad, so, yeah. I mean, like I said, I've changed so much since that Design the Skyline video came out. And that's what scene kids really need to learn. I don't even know if you're seen or anything. Just people... And actually, like, Design the Skyline has long since broken up. And the bassist even came to me on my video. The bassist of Design the Skyline came to me and said that he respected that I had an opinion. And I'm just like, thank you. Like, if only your fans or whatever thought that way too. I mean, but that's just not the case. Mm -hmm. Honestly, like, they've moved on to other projects, and they're doing their own thing now, which is good for them, and they just need to branch out a little bit more, and I'm totally, like, I'm just like, you know what? You play music, you do your thing. I mean, music, we all have different tastes, and my philosophy now is really just, you listen to your music, I'll listen to mine, and it'll all be hunky-dory. So, yeah. Basis of Design Skyline, I'm sorry I forgot your name. You just keep soldiering on with your solo projects as well as the rest of them. And, um, I mean, yeah, I never did like what Design the Skyline put out, but that's okay. I mean, you guys liked it. You had people that liked it. It's your music. It makes you happy. Go for it. Like, I'm not, tr I'm not trying to stop you. I was just voicing my opinion back then. I'm just saying, like, a lot of people still say that Guns N' Roses is terrible, but... It's music that makes me happy, and I still listen to it. So why why would you let someone's opinion stop you from that? Just listen to your music, people. Have fun. That's all I pretty much have to say for this video. I feel like I look pretty good today, actually. My hair's kind of messy, but that's whatever. I got a new sweater. Anyways, so yeah, I'll stop the video here. So... Like I said, just listen to your own music, have some fun, you know, design the skyline, go soldier on with your music, and just gotta let things like that go. You gotta let go of the past. I mean, a lot of my opinions in the old videos still don't hold up. I mean, I still think reality shows are stupid, but, I mean, Lady Gaga I don't mind. Katy Perry I don't so much mind anymore. Kesha I still can't stand, but I mean... That's just music taste, and then, like, a lot of my opinions have changed in the past years, so, like I said, people change. Get over it. So, yeah, I'll leave it at that. Bye!